Hey everyone, this is Axel Phones. I'm play facing Zorin at 708 and I'm at 824. He's going for a wave motion cannon. He's set. Uh, this is probably a burn deck. Okay. So I will be going for a heavy storm. I want to know how this Magna Gadget deck faces off against a burn deck. Now I have really no options, so I'm just going to set that. Call it a turn. Probably shouldn't have said that, but because I can bring out gores, but you know. Okay, don't want him having establishing a field if this is a burn deck. Okay. Okay, another wave motion. It's a okay. Okay, so I'm going to keep this gores in hand. So I'm just going to set this, and set that, and my turn. I'm just keeping that gores, you know, because it's effect with effect damage. Okay. Just playing it safe. Okay, I'm just going to end turn. I'm just waiting for that wave motion up, kind of to get up. So it's two. Okay, so I'm losing a thousand. This is indeed a burn deck. Okay, fascinating. Okay. Um. That could be a magic cylinder. Do I really want to attack? I have a dark drive out so I can summon him. And attack the Princess of Surugi. Does that go through? Okay, that does go through. Make this two. Set this. And turn. Cannons at three. Yeah, do I want that to go through? No, I'm not gonna let that go through. Just as a matter of principle, I enjoy having monsters on my side of the field. Okay, so um, that I wonder what that face down is. I mean, he's just keeping it there. So I'm assuming it's a monster. It could be a man eater bug, possibly. So he has a Prince of Surugi. Okay, okay. So I will summon Green Gadget. I'll sync for uh, Genix Ally Triforce, so he can activate traps when I attack. We'll be adding a red gadget, okay. Sync level seven. I, mean, I could blow up everything on the field. Yeah, I'm gonna. Four, five, six, seven. Effect, blow up. Okay, so he's gonna bottomless that. Priority, blow up field. So he was a marshmallow, okay. Okay, that was a marshmallow. Okay, so huh, I actually want to go for a monster reborn. I will bring out Black Rose, and I will be attacking directly for 2,400. 
This duel is going my way. That's that's good. Burn decks have always given me problems. I will be setting an ultimate offering. Hopefully he doesn't have an MST or a heavy storm. And I will call it a turn. So we'll go for a wave motion cannon. Okay, good with me. Okay. Wow, three wave motion cannons. That's hilarious. Hmm. Okay. Do I have a heavy storm? Did I already? Yeah, I already used my heavy storm. Okay, so he's gonna destroy that. Okay. Not much. Not a big problem. So it's either a monster that he's gonna take. Oh, okay, no monster. Okay, so. Okay, yeah, we'll summon Red Gadget. Effect okay. I mean, I doubt that's an effect Veiler. Well, that could be a solid morning, but I doubt he would do that. Because I don't. Because I don't really think a burn deck would use Solemn Warning or Judgment. I mean, they don't want to be taking damage. They want the opponent to be taking damage. So it just seems a little weird to me. I don't know where that face end is. So I will be activating Ultimate Offering. I uh, will be paying 500. Bring out Yellow Gadget. Effect. I will be getting a Green Gadget. It will pay 500. I'm almost on him. That's 14, 27, 30, 39. In fact, I will be getting a red gadget. And let's see, do I have any more? Um, I have one yellow gadget left. So I will summon him. I can keep on using it. There's no limit. He seems to think that there's a limit. Okay, yeah, so he understands the, the issue going on here. So I will pay 500. No more some yellow gadget. Effect. I will get that yellow gadget. Now, I want to go for game, but I'm a little worried that's like a Magic Cylinder or a Mirror Force. So I will be going for Shockmaster. Actually, no, let me summon a Yellow Gadget. Now, now I'm going for Shockmaster. Traps can't be activated until end of your next turn. Oh, okay, so obviously, you know, he gave up. He saw that this was game. Okay, so this was a burn deck. Let's see, at a gravity button. That's a decent card, but my Black Rose Dragon kind of screwed him over. Um, two wave motion cannons. Well, uh, three. It's a lot. I mean, considering the fact that MST could just destroy it so easily. Hmm. No, you know, Heat Drone, Princess Surugi. That's a really good card to have. Um, okay, and then uh, Marshmallow, of course. Any burn deck, I think, could find that to come in handy. Bottomless, um, Smashing Ground. Okay, that, that's good. <laughs> My Black Rose Dragon spelled defeat for him. That I think I think that I won because of the Black Rose Dragon. Without that, I would have had quite a bit more difficulty considering he had a gravity bind out and a bottomless trap pole, which would have just just stopped me from doing anything. And the Shockmaster I think was the final straw. So here it is. Um, I'm Axel Phones signing out.